So today I'm making one of my favorite dishes. It's a French apple tart. It's super easy. I don't want French to freak you out. Like as soon as someone says French, everyone thinks it's gonna be super intimidating and uptight and that's not true. So all you basically need is dough, apples. You can use Granny Smith apples. You can use Honeycrisp apples. I use the apricot jam. Um, some people use a rum, um, but you could a liqueur, but I, I just use water um, and then a little bit of sugar and butter. Uh, and I, I actually purchased a pre-made uh, pastry dough because, you know, you just need time. You could make it as simple as you want it. Like, don't feel like, oh my gosh, I have to make this dough from scratch. Not at all. Um, you can have everything you need. It's simple ingredients that I'll share. And let's get started. This is not a weapon, not a weapon, it is a tool. What's the difference between a tool and a weapon? So many things. There's nothing better than a great kitchen tool. Like this again may look like a weapon, what do you see? But actually it's one of my favorite tools for making a tart. So what you wanna do is you just take it and you're gonna put it right in the center. So once you have all the apples placed diagonal, then you're gonna add the sugar. Then you're gonna dot with the unsalted butter. And now we're just gonna put it in the oven and bake for 45 minutes. So then you're gonna take a half a cup of apricot jam. And you're gonna mix it with, I'm choosing to mix it with two tablespoons of water, but you can also use rum or a bottle of Calvados, it's called. So either of that, and you're gonna mix it together and heat it. So then you want to add the rum mixture over the entire tart. 